Okay. So it says, if each of the edges of a cube increase by a factor of 2, the surface, the surface area of the resulting cube will be how many times the surface area of the original cube? So the surface area. So I think what is really important here is to kind of like note how scaling works. So if you're basically talking in one dimension, and then you're jumping to two dimension, which is over here, which is a side, and over here, which is an area. So if you're basically uh, multiplying a factor of two over here, you need to square it up, and th this is gonna be like two times the two, which is gonna be like four. So, oh, so yeah, four. I never knew this was gonna be that easy. But let's try to play with this question, okay? Let's try to come up with a configuration. L let's say we didn't knew this scaling factor and how this works, okay? Let's come up with a possible combination and let's resolve it out, okay? So it says, in each of the edges, a cube is increased by a factor of two. Okay, let's draw this out. So we have a cube, okay? Crazy cube, but you get the idea, right? Okay, so it was increased by a factor of two. So if I want to keep it simple, um, if I get this is x, this is x, and this is x, and it is increased uh, by a factor of two. So the, our new cube is going to be something way bigger, something like this, almost double. It's going to have 2x, 2x, and this is also 2x, okay? And it's saying the surface area of the resulting cube will be how many times the surface area? Okay, so what's going to be the surface area of this one? Okay, so the surface area, if I'm talking about the one side, it's basically x squared. But since there are six sides, so I'm just going to multiply by 6x squared. And over here, uh, the second, which is basically increase, is going to be like, okay, so one side is basically 2x squared which is basically 4x squared. Uh, just give me one sec, man. Just let me uh, 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 finish this one so that I can, you know, uh, complete it efficiently. Okay, but uh, if I'm uh, talking about 6s, 6 4 to 24x squared, now all the thing which is remains is, okay, I need to find the ratio. How many times? Yeah, oh, okay, how many times? So 24 x squared is 6 times x squared, x, x goes out, 6, 1 is 6, 6, 4 is 24, and we got the same answer over here. Yeah, and Nahar, you wanted to say something? Yeah, uh, it's written increase by a factor of 2, does it mean uh, 2 is added like x plus 2? No, 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 when you're talking about a factor, you're multiplying, buddy. Okay. If you would have said that increased by two, increased by two, now you're adding. Like you see these percentage increases, right? Like we have this original value and this final value, and then we have this X percent, remember? So this is an increase. You following so far? Yes. Okay. So, uh, Nina, do you know how uh, this YouTuber was doing this question? Was there any new trick that we probably can learn? I think he was doing more in complex way, which I didn't understand. Okay, so you didn't understand. Okay, cool, cool. No problem, no problem. 